I am uh, just outside of the set. They're going to be going live in about a half an hour. We've got a lot of really creative signs. Show off your signs there, gentlemen. What does Wendy's have that Wisconsin doesn't? Four for four. Uh, Urban's favorite character from The Office is Angela. And I saw somewhere in there that, uh, oh yeah, the energy, the signs. Coming up, we're going to find out the impact these fans are going to have on college game day. Plus, we're going to reconnect with an alumni from right here in U of M. Well, the Wolverines are gearing up for tonight's big game against Wisconsin, and you can see it right here on 7. But first, ESPN's College Game Day is on campus right now. 7 Action News reporter Jennifer Ann Wilson is live in the middle of it. Jen, I know we've got, what, 11 hours until the game tonight, so these fans are diehard and they're getting a start early. Oh yeah, these are fans not only of U of M, but we've got fans from a, a couple of different places. They're all fans of ESPN's College Game Day. We've got some really creative signs. Badger, it's what's for dinner. And then you brought the whole family. Of course, uh, I, a bunch of signs here. Uh, well, some people trying to get Notre Dame, trying to get a hit. Really cool. I love seeing all the families out. Uh, you just joined your friends here. What's your sign? Yeah. Wisconsin, your mom called. You left your game at home. <laughs> I love this. So creative. And I mean, these are fans I've seen before. Check Woo! out these amazing outfits. Everybody go blue. blue. Big win today for us. <laughs> yeah, and you know what? I was actually talking to the host, or uh, not me, but Brad Galley was talking to the show host of ESPN's College Game Day, and he says it's fans like these, the creative, energetic fans that make them love coming here to Ann Arbor. Take a listen. I think that there's a deep pride and passion from the fans that you try to tap into and capture when you come to the come to the venue and try to touch the traditions and things that are meaningful to those fans when you're here. Well, we definitely have some creative fans. I met some of them last week, more of them today. We met fans who decked out an ambulance and turned it into a fan ambulance and uh, another group of fans that completely redid a bus. So uh, we have fans that go the extra mile here in Ann Arbor. That is for sure. But if you really want to grab the attention of College Game Day analyst and U of M alumni Desmond Howard, you got to go a little further than just being all out for the blue and gold. Here's one surefire way to win your way to his heart. If you need to, if you need to make Desmond like you, Get him some really nice donuts or something. My, uh, he, he and I share that now. When they bring out the food at the end of game day every week, it's like, uh, sweets can come right over this way. We'll take that. So. <laughs> Chase Winovich goes through linemen like he goes through hair products. <laughs> The creativity behind some of these signs is mind-blowing. I don't see any donuts out here yet, but Desmond definitely seems to enjoy the cheering. Every time he shows up on the big screen, the entire crowd chants his name. When they're not chanting his name, they are chanting for U of M. Got a lot of people excited here. The show starts in just a little bit. We're going to toss it back to you.